here for story time. I'm Super Nerd Gaman with the Greenfield School District, ready to read you a bedtime story. And tonight we're going to read The Night Before Hanukkah, which is a Jewish tradition. So thanks for joining. We're going to see what we can hear. And also, hello to our Kodiaks from Mary Choppa. So if you're a Kodiak there, go grab your t-shirt and join me for story time tonight. Hola, comunidad de Greenfield. Soy Superintendente Garban, aquí con ustedes de Distrito Escolar de Greenfield, leyendo historias, celebrando los días festivos de todo el mundo, aquí de California y de Greenfield. Y esta noche voy a leer sobre la, el, el festivo de Hanukkah que celebran las personas de Jewish descent. So vamos a leer de ellos. Y también quiero dar la hola, la bienvenida a todos los niños de Mary Chapa Academy, a los Kodiak Bears. So, hola a ustedes, gracias por estar aquí. Vamos a aprender de Hanukkah esta noche. All right, here we go. Twas the night before Hanukkah. Let's see what we can learn about this tradition. And here we go. Twas the night before the eight days of Hanukkah. Families were prepping from New York to Santa Monica. The children soon nestled, all snug in their beds, while visions of chocolate gelt danced in their heads. The very next evening, our family gathered round. The festival of lights began right after sundown. Our menorah was set out by the window with care. It's an heirloom passed down from our great grandma, Claire. So that's a menorah. We're gonna learn how they light those candles. Dad put on his yarmulke, which he puts on his hat, pinned it down on his hair. Then mom, it's the shomash candle after saying the first prayer. So she's lighting the candle in the middle instead of prayer. The flames, how they flickered, our faces cast in the light. We sang rock of angels while the candles burned bright. Then we opened our presents. Oh wow, earrings for me and a building set for my brother who just turned three. The next night we played dreidel. That's a top that you spin with four Hebrew letters on them. Nun, A, Gimel, and Shin. We each tossed in a coin made of chocolate called gelt. I snuck one and I ate it before it could melt. It was my turn to go. If it lands on Gimel, I win. But Shin turned up, so I put another coin in. Our dad won that game when our coins all ran out, but he divided up his winning. Sharing is what it's all about. That's what he said. Let's turn this page. Oh, no page. On the third night of Hanukkah, after the candles were aflame, dad read the story of Jewish heroes. Maccabee was their name. Let's take back our temple, the Maccabees led. With a shout, the Jewish people fought and won. And then they kicked the enemy out. Then they cleaned their holy temple and prepared the candle, the kindle the light. But the lamp had so little oil, it could burn for only one night. So they prayed for divine help and help did come indeed. The lamp stayed lit for eight days and God had met their need. Before their wondering eyes, a miracle took place, the glory of Hanukkah for all Jewish people to embrace. On the fourth night, we ate latkes, deep fried potato pancakes. On the fifth night, we ate jelly donuts, the ones my uncle Dan makes. On the sixth night, we visited our cousins. That's a family tradition. The ants made gravies and gravy and brisket. Yummy smells filled the kitchen. On the seventh night, to share our happy Hanukkah mood, we brought presents for others and lots of holiday food. On the eighth and the last night, my mom had some bad news to report. I don't know how this happened, but we're one candle short, she said. Don't worry, I said, and I pulled a drawer handle. We opened it up and I cried, my birthday cake candle, that will work. Mom placed it on the menorah, then lit them all left to right. Dad reminded us like our faith that they burned very bright. As the last candles burned like they had for eight nights, we wished a happy Hanukkah to all. 
the Festival of Lights. And that's the story for tonight. How wonderful that is. We get to learn now, you know this is a menorah and it's a Jewish holiday. So we learn something new as a tradition of other people that live around this world. Maybe you celebrate it too. So thanks for joining me. I'm Superintendent Galvan with the Greenville School District. So happy to be your superintendent. Wishing you a great night. So sending a great big bear hug from our family to yours.